Hey everybody, welcome back to more Dark Souls 2 Blind. As you can- oh. What are we doing last episode? We- So it's been a little while. We... Beat the Rodden, did we? Is that all we did? I think that's all we did. Okay, if that's all we did, I have some leftover souls now. I actually went and farmed just a little bit in Huntsman's Copes and got a- uh, Got about 10,000 souls there because I wanted to level up three times because I realized that, well, actually I didn't need to rest the bonfire, but I have to talk to the Emerald Herald. Because of how useful the poison, um, the poison attacks that we had were, like the, we have, well, we have the poison weapons and the, uh, the poison throwing knives, seeing as that was really really useful i was thinking that we could buy poison mist from the pyromancer lady and take our attunement up to 10. so we have an attunement slot now and with that we can attune poison mist it's got two uses so not that bad and we actually have a pyro we have a pyromancy flame, so I'm replacing the bow with my pyromancy flame. Actually, I might put the pyromancy flame in the left hand. What's the difference between a dark and uh, spell power? Spell power scales with hollowing. Okay, that's the difference between those two. But I don't think the power of the pyromancy flame actually matters. If only because the, um, Hello. I don't think the power of the pyromancy flame actually matters. Because it's just poison, like it's a flat effect. I don't know if it increases the buildup of the poison, but there's no way to really monitor that at the moment. So, what are we going to be doing this episode? We're going to be heading down into Blight Town 2.0. Because we've got that big ass key, and I think it'll fit into that big ass door that we didn't get to open the first time. So I thought I'd never have to come down here again, but obviously I was wrong. After that, we're gonna go back to the gutter, whatever it's called, because um, I feel like I missed a part of the area or something. I don't know. There's a lot of stuff in there that I missed, and I don't really want to go back, but at the same time, I do want to go back, because if there's NPC interactions there, then that's... Yep, yeah, okay. The key does open this door. If there's NPC interactions there, then I do want to have a look. Ooh. Three items. Okay. What's behind chest number one? Soul Vortex. Uh, it's in here. Well, success fires successive homing souls. That sounds fucking cool. Too bad we can't use it. Next we got Witch Tree Branch and Witch Tree Bellvine. I'm guessing that's a catalyst and a Witch Tree Bellvine. What is that? Yeah, seems like it's a catalyst, and this is the witch tree branch, which... Is that what the sorceress, sorry, the sorcerer in the beta had? Seems like it's what he had. Oh well. We're not going to use it, so we'll go back to our... Actually, we'll go to the poison bandit's knife. And we'll open this chest up. Last one. Great lightning spear, great. All things that we can't possibly use at the moment. Although we do have an attunement slot now, so if at some point I did want to learn a single miracle or something, I have that option. Alright, and we're going to climb all the fucking way up to the top of this hole again, because I'm just going to warp to the first bonfire down there. I hope that you can climb up. Actually, 
actually. Yeah. Probably can. Jesus Christ, this is a long ladder. So I already had a chat with everyone else, and nobody seemed to have anything new. Kind of a shame, but whatever. Travel to... Uh, the gutter. The first bonfire. Oh, okay. So this place still has a heartbeat, which is really disconcerting. Now how do you get up out of here? Not that way. Oh, we got a ring of giants as well. What does that do? Oh, I think I saw it increases poise. Rings. Ring of giants plus one increases poise. Okay. Alright. Well, I wanted to be able to just go up, but I don't think we can, so... Oh, try going this way. Okay, at least the running attack and two R ones kills it. Oh god, these things! What? I hate this place. I accidentally used the Paramity as well because I meant to shield, but I didn't get to. Shit. Two, three. Okay. Lock on is really weird. I don't think I really mentioned this before, but a lock on can be very strange at times with how slowly it pans up to different enemies in the area and which enemy it decides to pan to as well. There can be three enemies in front of you and it'll pan to the one in the back of the group. Oh, come on. There's seriously no way back. I hate areas like this. Should always be a way back. In my opinion. Poisoned. Sweet. Can't tell if you slowly lose health if you get poisoned and use a life gem. But this poison, I know for a fact, lasts longer than the other types of poison. Yep. Okay, so. Oh, god damn it. Uh, switch to the lightning greatsword. I like having a few weapons all pretty much ready to do damage. Like 
like this because we got the a few plus nine weapons now and a plus ten one and all of them are elemental poison but elemental oh god damn it I think we'll just walk back to Majula and we'll go down from the top because I th I don't know I think we're missing an area but then again I don't know how else to explore this place because I mean it took me long enough just to get to this bonfire so I don't know where else we could possibly be going Down we go. Found out that you can... Well, generally, if you roll the correct direction, you end up landing on that platform. You don't have to do the jump with, like, three steps. To prepare. Because the problem is that the, the game wants you to do a really fine jump at that point. But the problem with the Dark Souls jump is that, I mean, I know you can jump pretty much immediately from when you start running, but you have to be able to start running and you have to start running and you have to face the right direction or you have to turn the stick and press a button to uh, end up jumping in the right direction. And it's it's just not finely tuned enough for this sort of situation. See? You can land on that and take very little damage when you again as you saw so we headed to the left the first time when we came in here didn't we there's no there's no passage up here this is where we killed that crystal lizard that gave us the dark knight stone One, two, three, four, whoa, okay, <laughs> charcoal pine resin, fair enough. Alright, so let's go this way. Now we already went this way. We picked up lightning spear or no great heal or something. So we're down in the pit. Whatever this is. Guess we gotta find an alternate route. Then we go this way. Uh, there's, actually, there's plenty of possibility for there to be an alternate route down here with all the ladders there are. Mm, human effigy. Alrighty. Might just climb up here, have a look at what's up here. I think it's just, yeah, just a ramp. Back to where we were before. 
And I thought I'd hate the Jester's stuff, but the Jester's top doesn't actually look bad. It's gritty enough that it kind of blends in with the color palette that I've got for the rest of the character's clothes. And I was in PvP earlier doing the bell uh, invasions for Titanite chunks. Uh, I also got a Titanite slab from that after I talked to the, the Covenant leader dude, the little bell guy. And people didn't seem to be able to backstab me. Because I think the characteristic of the, of the Jester's armor is that it nullifies foe's critical attacks. People could uh, guard break me and do the guard break repost, but they couldn't actually do the the normal um, backstabs or anything. Well, here we are in the gutter again. Oh damn, I hate this place. Mainly because they do so much poise damage. These things. Fucking stupid. So. Okay. So, come on. Don't fall through. Don't fall through. Don't fall through. Don't fall through. The hell is that? That looks really badly textured. It's down here. Shit! <sighs> Just wouldn't let me walk off it straight. I'll see you guys when we get here again. And we're back. We notice we're, we're not actually at the bonfire, but... I'm gonna try something. Actually, I'm gonna... Talk to the cat. Look at her sitting at the desk like she's people. Uh, silver cat ring. 13,400 souls. Really? Do I have souls that I can pop to do that? People are going to hate me for this. But I'm not going to use Ornstein's soul. So. 10,000. And we need just a few more, so I'll see you again once we have just enough souls. Um, and we're back. You do have a, a type. Yes, hello. You're eccentric. I need that ring. Thank so you. Oh. Well, I want that ring. Damn, we have a lot of rings. I'm actually gonna use a human effigy because we have so many of them. And... Estus. Wow. All that for a radiant life gem. Ferris Lockstone, cool. This purchase seems worth it so far. Oh, 
poison moss. What the hell? There's another entrance down here. Grave of Saints. Oh shit. What is that? Is it a dragon or a... no. It's like a mouse. Alright. So, we found our new area. That's good. Going to put on the cover the silver serpent ring again because I like souls. Did you just laugh? Okay. Human skulls. Always comforting. Well, at least we practically one-shot these. Okay. Of course, because this is a video game, we cannot climb over stomach-high walls. Unless there's a button for it. And we can't crouch down to go look around inside graves or anything. It says rats over here. Jesus. These guys drop human effigies like before. Oh. Okay. Ah. Uh, was there any other way to proceed? I mean, it's a pretty big fall. There's a ladder here. We gotta kill this guy, and then we got the ladder. Small, smooth, and silky stone. Oh. What the hell does... What does this one do? I don't know. Oh, there's, there's another one. Okay. Invaded by dark spirit Roy the Explorer. Oh, what's he swinging with? What is he swinging with? He's got like a hidden weapon or something. I don't know, but this obviously isn't a player phantom, so I have absolutely no problems with healing. Oh shit. You. Hey, Invader Banished. Armor of Aurus. I already have one of those. Okay. There's a fog gate over there. Another Ferris Lockstone thing. And a second bonfire. Alright. Oh, we've got music. Oh, Jesus Christ.
gonna heal up. Never know when you're gonna get gang raped. Uh, I guess you have to kill like a bunch of his buddies before he'll come out. Yeah. There's a bunch of them. I think boys would do me good. Or not. Two. Three. Oh. I just did damage to the boss. Quite a lot of damage. Oh, it's the one with the spines on the wall. Okay, but the one with the spines does hit harder. Two, three. Okay. Ugh. And all the all the other rats just fuck off. Like that. Royal Rat Vanguard Soul and Rat Tail. Alrighty. It's not hostile. Leave Talk. this place, human. We have no time for thy kind. Humans bring nothing but filth. Is that a rat tail, human? Thou'st one of mine rat burrows conquered. This will not go unnoticed. Rejoice, for the right to serve me is now thine. Since um. thou art human still, permit me ask, wilt thou thy human soul surrender and pledge thyself to me? Swearest thou by the sweet-tempered sludge that laps at our bosoms? Gnawing Rat King Covenant. What the hell? Um. Of course. No. Be gone. We will tolerate. I have the feeling you can always come back and talk to them, but. Uh. uh. Wow. It's a big skeleton. Oh, Ferris Lockstone. Again, 3D platforming. Not my favorite. I do like how it's making you take pretty much no damage though. The ring, anyway. Oh, I'm not wearing the ring anymore. So we just found bleed stone. Oh, we're... We're here. God damn it. Was there really nothing else down there? Seems like it. That's a shame. I can't actually get out of here any other way, so... I guess we'll use a home and burn.
Okay, that was that was a small area, but we found another covenant, and that was cool. Weird covenant. I don't know. I'll have to look it up. I don't know what it does. Um, but we'll head back to Majula, I think. We've got some souls after all. Can maybe level up once more, because. I've been kind of stingy with the actual leveling up. I've been buying a lot of items, but I haven't been leveling up so much. Although I am out of, I am practically out of um, and you? life gems. So I think that takes precedence, actually. Thanks. By 68 of the damn things. All right. So. Thank you for watching. I don't know what we'll be doing in the next episode, but 